Hello, and welcome to the first ever episode of Top Trolley. I'm your host, Mosin. This is my kitchen, and this is my first love, food. In, on this channel, I have set out to fill your trolleys with the nation's best foods across all supermarket brands. And yes, that includes the newcomer, Amazon Fresh, which too will be tested against four core measures. Taste, price, main ingredients, and a mystery test. In the first series, each week I've decided to test the nation's favorite products, such as strawberry jam, baked beans, the now heavyweight crunchy nut cornflakes, and even frozen cod, something I'm very much looking forward to testing. Today, I just wanted to mention why I am on this journey, the testing that will take place on each product, what's in it for you, the viewer, and the free giveaways for subscribers each week, and also reveal at the end of the show which product will be first to face the top trolley challenge. So stay tuned. Have you ever considered why Kellogg's Crunch Nut Cornflakes is the nation's favourite cereal? Perhaps it's the taste, which one would hope it is. Perhaps it's just the brand power. You know, you see it everywhere and so you're more inclined to buy it. What if I told you that there are eight other manufacturers of Honey Nut Cornflakes? And in fact, that Asda is one third of the price of Kellogg's Crunch Nut Cornflakes. Yet it has more peanuts, less salt and less sugar content. Would you then reconsider? It's actually at Top Trolley that we are trying to educate our viewers by comparing all of these products across all supermarkets to ensure that you're filling your trolleys with the best of what the nation has to offer. Did you know that in January, we spent over one billion pounds more on grocery shopping than we did the year before. And online shopping went up by 14%. We now have information at the click of a button. Top Trolley will set out to be the nation's first comparison channel across all supermarket products to bring you information, stats, figures, and results so that you fill your trolleys with the best of what the nation has to offer in terms of taste, price, content, and a lot more. So join us on this journey of discovery to find out what products we should now be filling within our trolleys. Next, I will show you how we conduct the testing to ensure that it's consistent, thorough, and accurate. So stay tuned to find out more. probably looking at this daunting sight of 12 cans of baked beans and wondering, quite rightfully, how it is I'm going to go about testing all of these brands. It is in this section of the video that I'll explain to you how the process will work um, and also introduce you to the top trolley scoreboard. What I have done is selected all the baked beans across all supermarkets and then separated them into categories. The leading brands that produce baked beans and are well known to us will enter the final testing, the food wars. Then we will select one of the top four leading supermarkets from Tesco, Asda, Morrisons and Sainsbury's. And the one that wins the pre-testing will go into the final testing phase. Likewise, with the European brands Lidl and Aldi, we will select a winner. And finally, the more luxury brands such as Marks & Spencer's, Co-op and Waitrose. And of those, there will be one selected to go into the final selection for the final food wars. I will now take you over to the top trolley scoreboard to explain to you exactly how we will rank these final six and the algorithm that we, we will use to calculate the overall winner. So come and join me. Welcome to the Top Trolley Scoreboard. This is where things start to get really serious and we find out the winning brand. I'm just going to talk you through what the scoreboard represents. 
The one to five here are the five finalists that will be competing head to head for the food wars. The other four columns are the four different tests that we'll be conducting. The blind taste test will be carried out in the following manner to ensure that there is no bias nor an unfair advantage for one brand over any other. My glamorous assistant, my wife, will number the winning finalists one to five or six, depending on the number of qualifying brands, and then place their product into their corresponding bowls. Whilst then being blindfolded, I will go ahead with tasting and reviewing each product before ranking them. This will subsequently equate to a score on the top trolley scoreboard. Testing will remain consistent across all product tests. The only variable that will change are the number of people that will participate in the blind food tasting to give a more accurate result. The second column is the price test, which requires little explanation. Simply put, the most expensive product will score one point, whereas the cheapest product deservedly will score five points. The third test looks at the main ingredient within the product. So for example, if it's cod fish or frozen fish, then we will look at the percentage of cod within the product. And again, the highest value or percent will score five points, whereas the lowest will score a measly one. And finally to the mystery test. And this unfortunately will stay mysterious until the day of testing. But what I can ensure is that it will be highly entertaining and relevant to the product. And finally, and most importantly, the winning formula. Here we will number crunch to determine which brand within this product category is ranked number one. As you can see, we have given a double weighting to taste for obvious reasons. Once we calculate the total figures, if we find that there is a joint winner, then the one that has the best taste will be ranked the ultimate champion. So join us by subscribing to Top Trolley and following our tests so that we, together, can transform our shopping experiences for life. So, the whipping factor. What's in it for me, as in you, the viewer? And I'm so pleased you asked, because at Top Trolley we don't disappoint. Each winning product will be sent to one lucky subscriber, together with these very handy trolley quins, which seems quite appropriate for Top Trolley. Not only that, but we have bonus prizes that we will give away throughout the series, such as a salt and pepper shaker, or perhaps you'll be lucky enough to win an egg holder or two, and sporky without the eyes, but much more useful. And finally, one really lucky winner will receive Top Trolley merchandise at the end of the series. So guys, what are you waiting for? Subscribe below and join our channel and this fun adventure. You'll be pleased to know that there is another way you can get involved. As lockdown eases, our intention has always been to come to a location near you so that you can participate in the food tasting. Follow us on Instagram or on Facebook to find out all the latest updates and be part of this journey. I've dropped the links below. Give us a thumbs up if you like the video and share it amongst friends and family so that they can all participate and be eventual winners. Finally, the moment we've all been waiting for, the big product reveal. Can I get someone to dim the lights? Beat the drums, because the first product to face the top trolley challenge is, lo and behold, milk chocolate digestives. So follow us, stay tuned. If you want to find out if there is a product or brand brave enough to knock McVitie's chocolate biscuits off its top spot. I look forward to seeing you in the next episode when the official food wars begin. See you soon.